The movie starts in a prison where a police officer named Green is getting ready to deliver money to a high-profile prisoner named Balam. Despite being in prison, Balam runs illegal businesses like drug selling, human trafficking, and weapons trading with the help of his personal guards and luxurious facilities. He believes that prison is the safest place for him, away from his enemies. New prisoners, including an ex-officer named Jack accused of killing a fellow officer and robbing a bank, are brought to the same prison building as Balam. Officer Green stops Jack from entering his cell and taunts him, suggesting he won't last long in prison. In a flashback to a week earlier, Jack and his fellow officers execute a bank robbery as part of a plan to gather evidence against Balam and corrupt government officials involved in criminal activities. They successfully acquire evidence from bank lockers but are caught by other officers during their escape attempt. Jack's colleagues are killed, but he manages to escape after a fierce fight. When cornered by pursuing officers inside a building, Jack confronts an officer who was involved in his wife's murder. He reveals his face to the officer and jumps from the building, taking the officer down with him. Jack survives the fall, but the officer dies instantly. Later, Jack discreetly leaves the evidence bag inside the apartment of a reporter named Trisha, entrusting her with the task of exposing the corruption involving Balam and the government officials. He urges her to report the case to the district attorney's office. Back in prison, Jack finds himself sharing a cell with a prisoner named Silva. During lunchtime, a prisoner named Semyon, who is Balam's cousin, demands security money from a new prisoner. When the man refuses, Semyon and his men beat him. Semyon then approaches Jack for money, but before he can make any threats, the new prisoner attacks Semyon and his men, knocking them down. As a result, Semyon is thrown into solitary confinement by the guards. In a subsequent scene, Jack is taken to a secret prison where he communicates with Balam via security cameras. Balam warns Jack to stay out of his business and threatens him with a gruesome fate similar to that of his wife. However, Jack remains undeterred by the threats. That night, three of Balam's men enter Jack's cell and attack him. Despite being caught off guard, Jack manages to incapacitate the assailants without waking his cellmate, Silva. Meanwhile, Trisha continues her investigation into the evidence she received. After some searching, she uncovers Jack Stone's real identity. The next day, Trisha tries to deliver the evidence to the district attorney's office. However, she is unable to meet with the attorney and is directed to hand over the evidence to Mark, the assistant. Suspicious of Mark's intentions, Trisha decides to leave the office without providing him with the evidence. In the next scene, Trisha can be seen waiting for the attorney to leave his office so that she can meet him in person. As soon as he walks outside, Trisha approaches him and tells him everything about the evidence she has against the corrupt government officials and police officers. Attorney Johnson is impressed by her bravery and dedication, providing her with his personal card and asking her to contact him if she needs any help. After this encounter, Trisha visits Jack and informs him that she's working with the information he provided her. Hearing this, Jack expresses his concern for Trisha's safety and urges her to be careful with the information. Returning to his cell, Jack meets a prisoner named William, who advises him to be cautious of Balaam's men. In response, Jack reveals that he's not afraid of Balaam or Semyon and asks William about Balaam's cell location. However, William informs him that Balaam's detention cell's location is so secret that even most of the prison guards don't know about it. In the following scene, we're shown scenes of a female prison where two female prisoners are fighting. The prison guards intervene and separate them. Later, a prisoner named Elena is brought to Balam's cell, with Semyon and other prisoners present. Semyon and his men are there to collect security money without Balam's knowledge, and Elena is brought there for beating one of Balam's favorite female prisoners. Balam then announces a prize of $100,000 to the one who will eliminate Jack. Next, William tells Jack that Balam has put out a bounty on him. A group of prisoners forms and attempts to attack Jack but he easily defeats them with William's help. Meanwhile, Balam receives a call from District Attorney Johnson informing him about Trisha having evidence against him. Balam urges Johnson to finish Trisha while he eliminates Jack. By the end of the day, when Jack is working in the laundry room, 
A group of prison guards arrive and attack him to claim the reward proposed by Balaam. Initially beaten, Jack manages to fight back and defeat them. However, he is confronted by another group of prisoners ready to attack him. Before fighting them, Jack tries to reason with them, explaining that the prize is not worth the risk. Realizing the truth, the prisoners step back and walk away. As the events unfold, Trisha visits her friend Allison and confides in her about Balaam and the evidence she has against him and the corrupt officers working with him. In the next scene, Elena approaches Balaam's favorite prisoner, Kat, to apologize for her earlier behavior. However, instead of accepting her apology, Kat instigates another fight and punches Elena. Pretending to fall unconscious, Elena is taken to the prison doctors for treatment. When left alone, Elena unlocks her handcuffs with a paperclip, steals alcohol and medicine, and hides them in William's cleaning bucket. She then sneaks into an air vent, locates the CCTV room, and draws a map before returning to the medical room with William's help. Meanwhile, Trisha visits Jack and shares that she has gathered information about him. Jack reveals that his wife was killed by Balaam's men, including the police officer he was accused of killing. In a following scene, Jack discovers that William is actually an undercover officer. William explains that he's been working undercover for six months to expose corrupt prisoners and government officials. He reveals that Elena is also working with him to find evidence hidden in the prison. Suddenly, they are attacked by other prisoners, and a fight ensues. Later, Jack is thrown into solitary confinement while William is summoned to appear before the prison warden. Blaine. Blaine threatens William, demanding more money to continue his undercover operation. Meanwhile, Trisha attempts to meet with the district attorney but is unsuccessful. Mark approaches her again, asking for the evidence. In another scene, Balaam's daughter visits him, leading to his release from prison and transfer to the meeting chamber. William instructs Elena to commence her actions, leading to a series of coordinated events. Elena attacks the warden and sneaks into the CCTV room while William, disguised as a guard, heads to the control room. As Balaam prepares to leave the visiting room, William unlocks Jack's cell, allowing him to attack a guard and don his uniform. With Elena's help, Jack follows William's instructions to reach Balaam's cell. Meanwhile, Blaine and guards discover the break-in at the CCTV room. Elena escapes through the ventilation duct as William realizes there's limited time before Balaam returns to his cell. S. Chaos erupts in the prison with doors flung open. Prisoners unleash their pent-up anger on the abusive guards. Officer Green attempts to flee but is stopped by Jack, who pushes him into the crowd of vengeful prisoners. Meanwhile, William and Elena also engage in fierce battles with their attackers. In the midst of the chaos, Jack confronts Simeon and they engage in a brutal fight, despite Simeon's attempt to stab Jack with a knife. Jack manages to overpower Simeon and proceeds to Balaam's chamber. Outside the prison, Trisha is targeted for elimination by Allison, who is conspired with District Attorney Johnson. However, Mark, revealed to be an FBI agent posing as a prosecutor's assistant, intervenes and saves Trisha, exposing the corruption within the government. Back in the prison, William incapacitates Warden Blaine and other guards while Jack confronts Balaam in a one-on-one -on -one showdown. Despite initially being overpowered, Jack finds the strength to rise up and defeats Balaam, avenging his wife's murder. With the situation under control, the SWAT team arrives and restores order to the prison. William introduces Jack and Elena, acknowledging their roles in dismantling Balaam's criminal enterprise. The FBI arrests corrupt officials and police officers involved with Balaam. In the end, Jack is taken into custody by William with the assurance of eventual release,